This video will go over deleting your browser history and cache in Chrome and Firefox. Just a quick overview, browser history is the recorded history of the sites you visited in that particular browser. Cache is the browser temporarily saving website data, like images, so that the page loads faster the next time you visit. Cookies are how sites save information, like items placed in an online shopping cart, pre-filled form fields, or account login information. Just be aware that clearing your browser's cache and history may remove things like saved passwords, address bar predictions, or shopping cart contents. With that said, let's go ahead and start. We're going to start with deleting your browser history in Chrome. In order to do this, you can go up to the three button menu up in the top right corner, and you actually have two different ways of getting to this, and it will bring up the same menu both ways. You can either hover over the history menu and click on history, when you go to that page, you'll click on the clear browsing data link here, and that will bring up the menu option here. The other option is to also press on the three buttons, go down to more tools, and then click on clear browsing data. And as you can see, that will bring up the exact same menu. This is the clear browsing data menu. You'll see that you have a basic tab and an advanced tab. We'll go ahead and start with basic. For the time range, you'll go ahead and choose the amount of time that you'd like to clear your data for, anywhere between the last hour and all time. If you would like to clear your browsing history, you'll go ahead and choose the first option. And this will also clear history from your sync devices if you're logged into Chrome and have your other devices synced to it. If you'd like to clear your cookies and other site data, you'll go ahead and click the second option. And this will go ahead and sign you out of most websites. It will keep you logged into your Google account. If you'd like to clear your cached images and files, you'll go ahead and click the third option. This will also tell you how much space will be freed up if you do this. If you'd like to look at the advanced tab, you can go ahead and click there. This just breaks things down a little bit more. So if you'd like to clear your browsing history, your download history, your form data, passwords, and other information, you can go ahead and click any of these that you like. But when you're ready, you can go ahead and click Clear Data. And depending on how long of a time frame you chose, this may take longer or shorter of amount of time. So just be patient with it. Just be aware that some data is not deleted this way, such as search history, other Google activity, and extension data. I'll leave some links down below in case you want to learn how to do this. And that's the quick and easy way to delete your history and cache in Google Chrome. Next. We'll move on to Mozilla Firefox. Firefox has a similar interface to Chrome. To clear your history and cache, you'll go up to a similar menu, which is the three lines up in the top right corner. Click there. Go down to History. Click on Clear Recent History. And this will bring up the Clear Recent History box. Once again, you have the ability to choose the time range to clear anywhere between one hour and everything. And then here you have the option to download your browsing and download history, active logins, form and search history, cookies, and cache. So you notice on this one, they do not have an advanced menu like Chrome does, but this menu does include several things that the basic tab in Chrome does not. And once you're done, once you've chosen your time and what you'd like to delete, you can go ahead and press OK. Lastly, if you'd like a more detailed view of your information, you can also open up the menu, go down to Settings, Privacy and Security, and you can go through your information here. So you have your cookies and site data. You can clear your data here. You can also manage your data. And it will give you information on which sites are holding which cookies and how much space it's taking and when it was last used. You can also look through your logins and passwords, any forms and autofill information that you've saved. And you can also clear your history from here. One other nice feature is that you can set when Firefox remembers your history. So you can have it always remember. You can have it never remember so that every time you close the browser, it forgets what you've looked at. Or you can set custom settings here. That was clearing your history and cache in Firefox. If you have any questions for us, you can contact us on our website using the live chat. 
email us at asklibrarian at utesco.edu or call us at 210-567-2450.